since I was in astronomy class dropping a name with Carl Sagan. Uh, <laughs> I did, I took one class. I love Europa, who doesn't? Twice as much seawater as the Earth. Let's go, go, go. Space launch system, Falcon yes. Heavy. Go, yeah. go, go. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> And the discoveries that could be made on Europa would change the world. I mean, it would change the way everybody feels about being alive in the cosmos, if there's something like it. What do you think would be alive there? European fish people. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I, I don't know. But there's something intuitive about it to me that makes it, I feel like if amino acids are required, it would be a little bit like us, but completely different. Because it's not a terrestrial planet, it's farther out, it's kept liquid by the gravitational smushing of Jupiter. <laughs> when you have twice as much seawater as the Earth for four and a half billion years, are there Europanian fish people swimming around under the ice? Wouldn't it just be amazing? That would be just world changing. It'd be like Copernicus or Galileo. Or if we found evidence of life and it has nothing like us, that would also be very Twilight Zone cue the music spooky. Uh, this is a worthy use of our intellect and treasure to uh, elevate humankind, to help us know our place in the cosmos. Thank you all very much. This Thank you, everyone. Thank you.